Okay, so imagine you're in a rugby game. Now, imagine you're the ball. So, the ultimate goal is to get yourself to the try line and score. You want to get the ball to the try line. That's an outcome goal. Now, the process goal is how we get there. How do you get the ball to that line? Last season, Oli scored five drop goals. This season, Oli wants to score six drop goals. This is known as a performance goal, and he's comparing it against himself. When creating goals, you also need to think about the time span. We need to think about when these goals are going to take place, and they need to be realistic. We need to make sure that we are thinking about immediate goals and long-term goals. For example, Ollie's playing this season, so he wants to think about every game, and he also wants to think about the overall season. He may even want to think about next season.